Good afternoon, good morning, good night, depicting on whatever time you're watching this. I am Joey Bakeman. I'm just here um, for another quick update. A couple people requested this. Um, so it's not really too, too much of an update I can give you, but I'm just going to give you a couple things of kind of what's been going on that I've been reading. So with the checks, I will leave a link in the bio that will specify how they're going to send week by week. It will give you the date of when to expect your month if it's going income based, because it is income based. 10,000 and less will re are, are getting their checks the 24th. So that's what you'll see, 10,000 and less. 10,000 to 20,000 will start receiving it May 1st, which would be the following week, following Thursday, I, I wanna say. Um, excuse me, I have to clean my glasses off. Um, still dirty as hell, but following Thursday. Um, so in my bio, or excuse me, in my description, there will be an article that will let you know every week of the pay of the payout, going week by week, um, starting from income. You know what I mean. So that'll let you know if you're wanting to know when your money is going to come. With a lot of people, they've already started receiving their checks. Like I had uh, Bad Pals and a couple other people in my comment section letting me know, like, hey, they received the checks. One of my best friends just received this check, so the checks are on their way. But um, for a lot of people that are they're doing it income based, you will not expect a check if you're following in any one of those brackets until a couple weeks. So that would be the only thing that sucks. Also, I don't know if you've been paying attention about the they passed a $484 um, billion dollar bill that does not include the 2K um, tax, um, 2K uh, a month. Um, you know what I mean? Bill or thing everybody's been paying attention. We still don't know whether that's going to get passed. And in my mind, I highly doubt it will just because they're trying to roll the economy open. And don't get me wrong, that puts money in people's hands. But then that's going to a lot of people aren't going to want to go back to work if they know they're getting 2K a month. And imagine like you got three, four kids. Now you're getting, you know what I mean? And they're saying 500 a kid on that. So now you're getting like 3,500. Like, to fucking chill out the house, you know what I mean? Excuse me, I'm sorry, it's hot. I have to turn my AC on. Um, sorry if it's a little smoky. I was smoking in here before, prior to this video, so I didn't want to smoke on camera, so um, excuse me on that. But yeah, like I said, I know with the portal, once again, if you can, keep trying to update your information. I know from some people telling me, reading, Give the portal 24 hours. If it is still not working, give it 48 hours. If it is still not working, me personally, for a lot of people that are having trouble and problems with their mailing address, I would call H&R Block. I would call um, the Postal Service and try to update my mailing address through them. Because um, I already know in a lot of articles, they're saying the IRS are not accepting phone calls. So you won't be able to try to do it with the IRS. You're going to have to do it with the Postal Service. And you're going to have to do it um, through H&R Block if they don't already have your most current address. Um, like, I, like I said, like in my other video, if you know what I mean, you can't do that, I would go post up at the mailbox. You know what I mean? Like I said, keep it a 12 with you, keep it a 100. I say 12 instead of 100, so that lets you keep you up to speed with me. Um, to keep it a 12 with you, if, like I said, if you gotta go post up at your old address mailbox, show them your ID, say, hey, bro, this is where I live. You know what I mean? Um, or where I used to live, uh, my stimulus check's supposed to come, show them your ID, you know what I mean? That is another option. Um, to, to doing that or you could just wait and see if they'll redirect your mail um, a lot of people like I said still haven't gotten theirs and from what I was reading make sure you're eligible you know what I mean that's rule number one if you're eligible to get one then we can proceed with the following steps after that but if it's saying that you're not eligible I would really look into that because that's most certainly means that you probably won't be getting the stimulus check so um, 
You know what I mean? Make sure that you are eligible because that could be the number one problem. Of course, the portal is glitching. I need people to understand that this is a 30, 40 year old system that has not been updated to handle this type of wear and tear. You get what I'm saying? Because we're putting a lot of wear and tear because people are still filing. Then they still got to send checks to 150, Ameri 150 million Americans. They still have to do the small, excuse me. They still have to do the small business. Um, you know, small business. I know most of the money is pretty much gone, but they still have to process that and get that sent out. So they're juggling a lot of things. Plus, they're having to work remotely from home. So a lot of stuff is going into why there's so many delays, why you haven't getting yours. Um, but like I said, like I've been, everybody in my comments, maybe since the first video, we cannot go to H and R Block ever again. We got to hit their pockets when next tax returns or next tax return season comes. Same thing with uh, Jackson Hewitt. We cannot go to them. We're better off just filing through TurboTax, sending it to a bank account or sending it to a little prepaid debit card or sending it you know, to my net spending card, however we set it up. But we cannot go through H&R Block. They, we have to let them know this was irresponsible. This was unacceptable. Like I said, you all you had to do was like either fix it or let people know, hey, because you did the advance refund, you're going to have to wait for a check. But once again, I still hadn't even seen a statement issued by them. All y'all say is, oh, we're seeing how they're going to process it when everybody already knows hey if you got the emerald or if you did the advance refund you're going to expect a check you know what i mean um and it's income based if a lot of people have been wondering when their check is going to come it is income based meaning like i said the april 24th is supposed to be ten thousand and less so people that earn ten thousand dollars and less for the for the following year they're supposed to be getting their checks first 10 to 20,000 will be released May um, 1st and then like following after that. You get what I'm saying? But in the link in the description will give you the list of all of the dates when the checks will supposed to be coming out. So that'll give you a little bit of breather if you've been wanting to know when it's supposed to come so you can kind of plan. But still, like I said, because a lot of people are getting theirs, the system is still, in my opinion, all over the place because people are getting their shit early. You know what I mean? So is it look it's looking like from what I've been hearing and seeing that they are above schedule. So that could be pushed up a little bit more, but there's no guarantee. I'm just going, I'm just telling you, but what the sheet is saying that hey, it's supposed to release April 24th. If you got it um a day early, phenomenal. Um that's that's amazing. Like I said, lend a hand where you can, where there's five, ten dollars to somebody, let them get something to eat, you know what I mean, smoke with them, if you just got a little bit of bud, whatever it is, you know, you get them a little beer, whatever it is that they need, just, just help them out, you know what I mean, I'm not saying you gotta spend your whole check, but a little five dollars ain't gonna hurt you, you know what I mean, it's just five dollars, you're gonna go spend it on something else that's more than five dollars, so... That's just my opinion. It is your money. I'm not going to really tell you. I'm just giving you suggestions. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah, like I said, I just wanted to give you this update. Just kind of let you know. Like I said, the, the scheduling date will be posted in the description of when the checks are supposed to be sent out. A lot of people are already getting theirs. Like I said, give it 28, uh, excuse me, excuse me, give it 24 to 48 hours for the portal. If you're trying to enter your information, if you're trying to update your mailing address, do it with H&R Block and the Postal Service. Um, and if you can't do that i would post up where the mailbox is um with the 2k bill it's most likely not going to get passed because it was not included in the 484 uh, billion dollar um extension that pretty much is what you can call it plan it was not included in that so i wouldn't get your high hopes up for the 2k bill um I know they just passed uh, for Wednesday, so excuse me, if you're a social security beneficiary, um, 40 senators are pushing to get your money sent to you ASAP. I know they just passed to where some um, illegal immigrants are supposed to start getting a stimulus check. Um, so, you know what I mean? That That's that. You have your opinion on that. I, we, we can talk about that at a later time or one-on-one. -on -one. But yeah, uh, illegal immigrants are supposed to get a stimulus check as well. Um, I know for a lot of social security people, they were supposed to start coming out this week. A lot of SSI people, they were start supposed to coming out this week. So like I said, it's just a little quick update. I know this video is like 10 minutes long. I apologize, I wasn't even trying to get it 10 minutes long. Once again, like I said, I wanna let you know every point, the checks are on their way though. 
they are on their way. So like I said, just be patient. I know it sucks. I know it's bullshit. It's everything in between that you want to call it. But all we can do now is simply wait for the money to get here. If our money's already got here, let's help somebody out in between. Like I said, I thank you for watching. Um, I thank you for commenting and helping somebody out. Because like I said, I'm not perfect. I don't have all the answers. And if you know something and you can help the next person out, I, I would love it if you would comment. I love that you are commenting and you're helping. And the comment sections are so positive and helpful. You know what I mean? I appreciate you. You know what I mean? Because we're, we're a tribe. So I appreciate you, you know what I mean? Showing love and supporting and liking and subscribing. You know what I mean? Because like I said, we're on the road to 1,000 now. So like I said, I'm in this video now because I've been ranting way too fucking long peace and love happy work day off day anniversary birthday first time to the channel i'm out stay safe